Have you ever wondered about NASA's plans for future space exploration? The intrigue of the unknown has always been a driving force for humanity, and NASA's Artemis program is a testament to that. This ambitious initiative is set to revitalize human space exploration, taking giant leaps that echo the legendary Apollo missions, yet, this time, we're not just visiting. The Artemis program is focused on returning astronauts to the moon, but with a twist. This time, the goal is to establish a sustainable presence, a home away from home if you will. But the moon is not the final destination. Oh no, it's merely a stepping stone, a launching pad for the ultimate goal, Mars. Yes, you heard it right. The Artemis program is not just about lunar exploration, it's about laying the groundwork for our future crewed missions to the Red Planet. So, let's dive deep into the Artemis program and its various missions. The Artemis program is organized into multiple missions, each with its own unique goals. Let's start with Artemis Worst. This mission is a crucial uncrewed test flight for the Space Launch System, or SLS, and the Orion spacecraft. With Artemis 1, we're pushing the boundaries of human engineering, sending Orion thousands of miles beyond the moon, farther than any spacecraft built for humans has ever flown. Next up, is Artemis II. This mission marks a significant milestone as the first crewed mission of the program. Astronauts will embark on a multi-day journey, orbiting the moon and returning safely to Earth. It's a mission that will test our capabilities and resolve in ways we've only imagined. Finally, we have Artemis III. This mission brings us back to the lunar surface. Astronauts will touch down on the moon, exploring new territory and paving the way for future lunar inhabitants. With each mission, we are one step closer to sustainable lunar exploration. An important part of the Artemis program is the gateway concept. Imagine a lunar orbiting outpost, standing as a beacon in the darkness of space. This is the Gateway, a critical component of NASA's Artemis program. Its primary role is to function as a staging point, a space-based pit stop if you will, for crewed missions heading to the lunar surface and potentially even beyond. But the Gateway is more than just a celestial rest stop. Envisioned as a modular spacecraft, it's designed to support a wide array of scientific and exploration objectives. Its flexible design allows for the addition, modification or removal of modules as needs and technologies evolve. This adaptability opens up a world of possibilities, from conducting groundbreaking lunar research to testing technologies for deep space exploration. The Gateway stands at the forefront of a new era of space exploration, a testament to human ingenuity and our yearning to explore the cosmos. The Gateway is not just a station but a stepping stone for further exploration. The Artemis program isn't just about reaching the moon, it's about staying there. This ambitious initiative goes beyond the short-lived Apollo missions to aim for a lasting presence on the lunar surface. How, you might ask? By developing technologies for in-situ resource utilization. Imagine, extracting water ice from the moon itself to support extended habitation. It's not just about survival, it's about sustainability. But Artemis isn't a solo mission, it's a global effort. The Artemis Accords, a framework for international collaboration, is in place to ensure that this lunar exploration is a shared journey. Countries across the globe are invited to participate, pooling together their resources and efforts to make this moon mission not just an American dream, but a global achievement. Through international collaboration, Artemis aims to unite the efforts and resources of multiple nations in the exploration of the moon and beyond. While the moon is our immediate goal, Mars is not far from sight. The Artemis program isn't just about returning to the moon, it's a stepping stone for the ultimate frontier of human exploration, Mars. The lunar missions under Artemis will serve as invaluable test runs for the even greater challenges that a crewed Mars mission will present. By establishing a sustainable presence on the moon, we'll gain experience in long-duration space travel and habitation, critical factors for a Mars mission. The Gateway concept also plays a role in this, as it could potentially serve as a blueprint for a similar outpost in Mars orbit. In essence, every aspect of Artemis, from the lunar landings to the resource utilization strategies, is a dress rehearsal for Mars. The lessons we learn, the technologies we develop, and the collaborations we foster will all contribute to making a human mission to Mars, a reality. The Artemis program is more than a mission, it's a new era of space exploration.